Hey guys, so bouncing off of Sully's question from Tuesday on what our favorite musical is, um, I thought I would first share some of my other favorite things. So first off, we have this shirt that I'm wearing right now. Uh, you might recognize the reference. Um, I absolutely love this shirt, um, basically because, well, I love Honey Badger, and also because my roommate gave it to me um, when he went to Colorado for a conference. Another favorite thing is this. Ah! which you might recognize as the John Green box set. Um, I'm really excited to finally read all of these John Green books um, because I haven't read any yet. Um, first thing, this, uh, this terrible bottom of my box. Um, thank you, Amazon. I was not happy about that. So the first John Green book I'm reading is Looking for Alaska. Um, I'm actually about... Uh, 92 pages in. Uh, they just had Thanksgiving. I haven't gotten to any of the emotional parts yet. Um, I'm a little excited and really, really scared of that, so... Um, oh man. So far, uh, Looking for Alaska reminds me a lot of my favorite book, um, which is a good thing. My favorite book is The World of Normal Boys by Cam Sonlein. Um, it's probably not very well known to most people. Um, sort of a... a gay lit novel, I guess, um, but not, not in a smutty way. If we ever did a Last One's Book Club, um, I would definitely recommend this book. I really identified a lot with the main character, and I think that it would give you a lot of insight into how I felt in the past. I also really like stuffed animals. Um, this is Baby Mickey, my newest edition. Um, I think I, I got him at Disneyland, and uh, I really like babies, and I really like Disney, so Baby Mickey. This is Smitty. Um, he's a sea otter. That I bought at the local aquarium um, and he's really cute and I love sea otters and he also came with chocolate so you know what's not to like. So I guess that segues into my favorite musical. I actually have two favorite musicals. I can't really decide between the two. Um, my favorites are Wicked and Book of Mormon. Um, I actually sang Defying Gravity for my choir audition a couple years ago. I saw Wicked a few years ago in LA. Kelly, the soundtrack is amazing but you really need to see the show. Um, to really appreciate how awesome Wicked is. I don't have a lot of Wicked paraphernalia right now here, so um, I'm going to show you some of my Book of Mormon stuff. So first of all, um, I have the playbill from when I went. Um, my brother bought me tickets for my birthday this year. This is a magnet that I bought there. And the next part requires a costume change. Uh, I had to dress up a little bit for this part. Um, this is my Book of Mormon missionary t-shirt uh, that my brother's girlfriend bought for me uh, for Christmas. Um, I was so excited to get this. Uh, I really, really wanted this when I went to see the show, but it was like so expensive that I didn't, I didn't buy it, but she bought it for me anyway. Um, so this actually works perfectly because I have a mission companion, this guy. Um, he is Elder Cuddlingham, and he's my mission companion. So see, he wants you to read the Book of Mormon. My last um, Book of Mormon thing is this frog here. Um, I can't tell you what he is if you haven't actually seen or heard the show before, so um, I'm just going to say he's my uh, magical frog. One last thing, happy Cagemas. Um, Sully actually got me a Cagemas gift. This is it. This is the note that came with it. That's it for this video. See you guys next week. Also, I'm totally winning.